what's going on guys living good zombies here back with another pokemon go video and in today's video guys we are talking about this year's go fest because there is another leak for this year's event and that is because i guess the go fest 2024 logo has been data mined so somebody did dm this to me um so the logo it does of course resemble what mythical pokemon what brand new mythical pokemon will debut via special research at the event so the logo does look like this okay so when most people did see this logo they immediately thought of the mythical pokemon that would be featured at this year's event and that is a gen 7 mythical pokemon and that is the fighting and ghost type pokemon mars shadow guys so mars shadow of course awesome mythical pokemon again fighting and ghost type pokemon from gen 7 this of course does resemble that logo for this year's go fest because those like squiggly lines on both sides of the logo do resemble the horns those wispy horns on mars shadow right i mean that's pretty much the big hint here on the logo as to which mythical pokemon would be featured at this year's go fest via special research do remember last year's logo was this and of course we all knew that diancy would be featured and that is what happened we did get diancy and also mega diancy at last year's go fest that was a pretty good pick for sure definitely do like that mega it's very very good in the game too so yeah this year it should be the year of mars shadow guys we should be getting this brand new mythical pokemon featured at this year's go fest and i guess we also should be getting rcs2 because there are some leaks about rcs being featured at this year's go fest 2. do remember the big releases for last year's go fest was mega rayquaza and raids and also the brand new mythical pokemon was the diancy and the mega diancy and now this year it's looking like it might be possibly rcs and raids 2 and mars shadow via the special research just like how diancy was last year so yeah this year's go fest is looking pretty good i am hoping that with the mars shadow we also do get zenith mars shadow since we got mega diancy as well i hope that we also can see zenith mars shadow which does look like this by the way the green one is the non-shiny and the purple one is the shiny now the mars shadow does change into the zenith form i do believe when it is attacking so hopefully we can see mars shadow change its form while it attacks and go into the zenith mars shadow that would be pretty sick because the zenith form does look pretty awesome so i am hoping that that will be possible once we do catch this via special research at this year's go fest but yeah if we want to take a look at the stats of mars shadow via pokemon go hubs database which again this is not set in stone these of course could change but at this point in time the max cp value at level 50 is 4217 for mars shadow with a 265 attack stat 190 defense and 207 stamina so it does have a pretty good attack stat for sure uh but the move set for mars shadow is currently not in the game so if there is a data mine here soon that does add moves for mars shadow like maybe sometime next month or the month after then we can for sure expect to see mars shadow at this year's go fest now it also does make sense to drop mars shadow at this year's go fest because we are getting some new ultra beast pokemon which are from gen 7 2 poi pool is getting a special research release via this next season two and i do believe that mars shadow in the pokedex is right before poi pool so guys if mars shadow does come out for this year's go fest are you excited to catch this pokemon let me know your thoughts on a mars shadow release via special research and possibly rcs release via some type of raid let me know your thoughts down below guys thank you so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed drop a like in the video subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in the next one peace